Hello friends, in this video I am going to explain you the easiest way to solve two digit multiplication. So after watching this video, you can solve any two digit multiplication within seconds. In many YouTube videos, you will get minimum two steps to solve this problem. But in this video, you will find only one step to solve this problem. So let's take an example as 61 into 19. So first multiply 1 into 9 is 9 and then cross multiply the numbers. 6 into 9 is 54 and 1 into 1 is 1. 54 plus 1 is 55. Take this 5 here and carry the other 5. Now 6 into 1 is 6, 6 plus 5 11. So 1159 is the product of 61 into 19. Easy right? So let's take another example as 72 into 24. In the same way multiply 2 into 4 is 8 and cross multiply the numbers. 7 into 4, 28 and 2 into 2, 4. So 28 plus 4 is 32. Take this 2 here and carry the 3. So now 7 into 2, 14 plus 3, 17. So the answer is 1728. Let's also try another method. We'll take 43 and 21 as example. Mark 3 blanks. And now, in this first blank, we need to multiply the tens place. That means first digit in the first number and first digit in the second number. 4 into 2 is 8. And to fill this blank, we need to multiply unit digits. That means second digit in the first number and second digit in the second number. 3 into 1 is 3. So to fill this middle blank, we need to multiply 3 into 2, 6, plus 4 into 1, 4. That means 6 plus 4 is 10. We can only keep one digit in this blank. So write 0 and take 1 as carry. So sum of this number is your answer. 3, 0, 1 plus 8, 9. So 43 into 21 is 903. Now let's take a bigger number that is 97 into 49. So first multiply tens digit of the number 9 into 4 is 36. And to fill this bank sec unit digit number 7 into 9 is 63. So write 3 and carry 6 here. So to fill this middle blank multiply 7 into 4 plus 9 into 9 that is 28 plus 81 will give you 109 so write 9 here and carry 10 so sum of this number is your answer 3 6 plus 9 15 and again carry 1 1 plus 6 7 and 1 plus 3 4 so 4 7 5 3 is your product of 97 into 59 49 now we will learn how to multiply partially complementary numbers in easiest way. Before multiplying, let me tell you what actually partially complementary numbers are. The sum of unit digits should be 10. That means 2 plus 8 equals to 10. And the tens place digits should be equal. So this is a partially complementary number. So let's multiply it. So first multiply unit digits. That is 2 into 8 is 16. So last two digit numbers are 16. And now 4 into the next number. That means 4 into 5. The next number of 4 is 5. So 4 into 5 is 20. So the first two digits is 20. So this is the answer. 2016. Simple, right? So let's take another example. 63 into 67. 3 plus 7 is 10 and 6, 6 and 6 are equal. So this is a partially complementary number. So let's multiply it. Now 3 into 7. 3 into 7 is 21. So last two digit number is 21. And the after number of 6, 7, that means we need to multiply 6 into 7, which gives 42. 42 is the first number. So 4221 is the answer of 63 into 67. If you find these methods helpful, 
Don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel and please complete 200 likes.